we're going to be tying up a simple to make saltwater streamer. To tie it, we'll start off with some white thread, secure it to our hook shank, and snap the excess free. We'll then grab some holographic tinsel. Here I'm using red. Secure it to our hook shank, wrapping backwards slightly into the bend of our hook. At which point, we'll reverse our thread's direction back up towards the head of the fly, laying an even thread base for our following steps. And if you'd like to win this fly, comment hashtag flies in the comments below. And if you don't win and would like to try some out, you can pick some up by submitting this custom order form here. Once we reach the head of the fly, we'll whip finish, set our thread aside, grabbing our holographic tinsel and wrapping it forward in closed touching spirals, slightly overlapping the previous wrap. You can do this by just wrapping it around the hook. However, it's much easier if you have a rotary vise. However you do it, continue wrapping it forward until you reach your thread. At which point, we'll secure the holographic tinsel in place, taking thread wraps both in front, as well as behind, and snipping your excess free. We'll then paint it over with some UV resin to add some shine and durability to our pattern. Fix it in place with the UV light, wrapping back on it slightly to lay down a base for our following steps. We'll then grab some bucktail, here I'm using white, snip a small clump free and measure it to be about two times the hook shank in length. Take one wrap around your material prior to securing it to the top side of your hook shank. This will help ensure that your deer hair doesn't spin around your hook. Before securing it down tightly in place, snip the excess free. Secure your tag ends tightly, taking a few wraps behind the bucktail, helping to prop it up and give it a better look. At which point, we'll grab some angel hair, securing it to one side of your fly, before folding it over and securing it on the other. Snipping it to length and whip finishing to hold it all together. Snip your thread free and paint over the side of the fly with some super glue. We'll use this to secure some eyes in place. Here I'm using living eyes in the color fire. Secure them to either side and add some UV resin to both the upper side as well as the under. Fix in place with a UV light. And this is a simple saltwater minnow that's made to imitate small bait fish. This is one of my particular favorite variations. However, you can tie it in a variety of colors to match your local forage. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more, and I will see you in the next one.